So, ha has life changed for you now that you got uh, you're in the UFC? You got to win. Uh, well, no, probably good. my life is the same. I just train harder. I just eat better, and I and I'm more motivated than ever before. Um, is your schedule the same? Do you still go to school and train, or like, what, how's your daily life? <laughs> no, I had to stop my school. You know, uh, it's really difficult for me because I love both things. But now that I'm young and I de and that I have energy in all my body, I I would like to uh, fight <laughs> now. So, so full time, you're, you're yeah, dedicated I full to this time. full time. I, now. I do the three three. Three training per day. Uh, I sleep the weekend, and <laughs> and that's all this all the weeks, you know. Are you glad to have that first fight behind you, the first UFC fight behind you? Yes, of course. I was really excited. Uh, it was a tough fight. I was really nervous, but I thought uh, I can, I could handle with that. And my team and me always work very, very hard for that. Was it the way you expected it to be? When you walked in there, like the, ex the experience of it as opposed to just dreaming about it? Yes, of course. You know, uh, my debut in Mexico was the best thing ever c could ever happen for me because everybody was cheering my name, everybody was supporting me, and I think that that was really important because you can feel the energy of all the people. Were you nervous? Yes, of course. I was really nervous because I, I wanted to do everything perfect. You know, I didn't want any, any mistake. What does that mean to you to be able to kind of... Uh, Build, uh, you know, fighting and MMA in Mexico being, you know, that, that is your background and uh, probably a lot of fans look to you as a role model. Um, I, like I tell you, I wanted to do the things as best as I can. I just want to be a, a good role model for the young girl, for the young people that um, uh, change their minds, that doing uh, things with respect, with discipline and, and, and being responsible could be uh, so amazing in your life. <laughs> When did they call you with the fight for police? Um, what? When did they call you uh, with the, with the police fight? Uh, I think uh, two weeks, I guess. And was that a surprise to you? Did did you expect to fight police? Was that a name that you? Pronounced? No, I never expected to fight police. You know, I I saw her uh, in Adam Victor. I I thought, well, I think she has one of the. Um, Best bodies uh, in the in the MMA, and I, and I really wanted to have one like that. I'm I'm still working on that, but um, it's amazing, you know, because she's a veteran, and, and I and I saw her fights, and and I was when when I didn't fight in a big time, I was like, whoa, those girls are amazing, and and now to fight, I'm fighting with her. It's oh, it's a pleasure, and it's really a blessing for me. When you saw her invicted, did you ask her for any workout advice, or did you did you just? Did you, did you not talk to her or? No, because she when when I get in Invicta, she was already in the UFC, so I never saw her. So what do you think of her as an opponent? Where is where is she really dangerous, and where do you think that you can you match up well with her? I think I should be more careful because she won twice to Heather, and if Heather was kind of difficult, I think she's going to be more difficult than her, and I just um, well I think that I have to train harder. <laughs> yeah. What's, what's the toughest part? Is is because you're essentially you're fighting the same women you're fighting in Invicta. I mean, there's you know the main event tonight is you no know, two Invicta fighters. You know your teammate just fought another Invicta fighter. You're fighting another Invicta fighter. <laughs> um, is does it feel the same as far as training and the actual fight? I mean, does anything change or is it just there's brighter lights? Yeah, I think just uh, brighter lights and and how can I say it's more. I don't know because UFC is the biggest uh, platform of fighters. I, I think it's the elite fighters, and um, well, if we are here, it's for something. You know? <laughs> Just uh, I think it's more people, more cameras, more lights, and more pressure. <laughs> is the pressure? What is the, is the pressure tiring? Does it inspire you? What, what no, no, it's like? motivating me because, like I told you, I just wanted to do as well as, as best as I can, and sometimes I just. Um, Get in like I want to do it. I want to do it, and I and I just want to do it so good. <laughs> um, you're going. You're the co-main event. Yes. Right, yeah. Um, I guess. How does that feel? Are, are you Are you excited about all these cameras? And there's gonna be a lot more cameras on Fight Week. Is it? Is that something you're nervous about, or you like you want you like you like the attention? Uh, well, I I like it. Of course, I I get nervous too because. Um, Everybody is watching on me. Everybody is uh, is hoping uh, I can do it good, and 
Yes, I, I like it. You know, I, it, it motivates me because I want to show the world that doing uh, the right things, you can achieve a lot of, of good, good things. <laughs> As an undefeated fighter, do you feel a lot of extra additional pressure to keep that record? I mean, you know, to stay undefeated and work your way towards the title? Um, no, I, I don't think it's pressure. I just, I just think that, like I told you, uh, I, I've been working very hard for that. I really, really work hard, and uh, I just think that being undefeated is, is because of all my work and my teamwork. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. There you go. Yeah, yeah. Thanks. <laughs>